SoloWinds Take Control is a fast, powerful, and safe remote support solution that gives you the ability to offer IT support to clients from wherever you are. Take Control offers both attended and unattended support. Attended remote support includes great communication capabilities like live chats and VoIP, as well as fine-tuned visibility into users' monitors and machines. Several ways to request and receive support are also available. An attended support makes use of the Take Control service installed in your managed devices for seamless remote access with several security options available in products. For either type of access, our tech console and the remote viewer put the tools techs need to diagnose and resolve issues right at their fingertips. From detailed system information to editable registries, Take Control gives techs a clear view into systems to offer great support. Now, let's jump into a demo environment and look at the product itself. This is the Tech Console, where you will live as a technician providing support. From the Tech Console, you are able to remotely connect to managed devices in an unattended fashion, where you can make use of our group structure to organize said devices as you see fit, allowing easy management with groups and subgroups. And the best part, permissions are available to widen or shorten device access where some technicians may need visibility onto devices while others don't. This is where you can also generate attended support requests on the fly to provide a pin code or a direct link to your end user. On that topic, attended support comes in two flavors, a simple request for attended support or a calling card, which can be managed from the administration console of Take Control. A calling card allows you to control duration of support, expiration of said support requests, especially useful when you offer blocks of hours of support or promotions where you may provide six month to one year support. Under the Pending Requests tab, you will see support requests from both attended and unattended users and devices. A web chat feature is also available, so you can chat with your clients even before starting a remote support session. Now, let's dive into a remote support session flow. I've generated a PIN code, and now all the user needs to do is access startcontrol.com or your own branded PIN code submission page to download the support applet and request your support. In a few seconds, the support request will reach your tech console and you can accept it right away. Just click on the support session, click accept request. SoloWinds Take Control has several options available for requesting attended support outside of the landing page, such as your own web page, a button in your website, a desktop shortcut for ease of use, and many more. On that note, support requests can also be automatically routed to specific technicians and departments or to a general queue. Let me take you on a deeper look of a SoloWinds Take Control support session. On the top, you can see the five main tabs for remote work on the left side. The Remote Desktop tab, where we can access view options like changing color, changing remote resolution, or even switching terminal user sessions if needed. On the Interactions menu, we have full clipboard control. Remote printing and keyboard mapping are also available. On the right side, I can configure session inactivity timeouts or even apply dark mode. Going to the computer menu, I can access reboot options, request credentials. On the top bar as well, you'll find the display switcher, chat with the end user, session recording with unlimited storage for up to two years, and integration with our own password and documentation management product, Passportal, for seamless credential injection while on a take control session. Now, the System Shell tab 
is where we can find command line interface and even use PowerShell on the top right corner. Going to the file transfer tab, we have a queue for the transfers and a resume function if needed. Registry editor is also available. And going to the system info tab, this is where as a technician, I can fetch information about system information, kill a process, restart a service, or even configure the startup type, consult on drivers, applications, Windows events, and Windows updates. And all of this information can be rightly exported on the top right corner to a CSV file for further manipulation. Also, from the remote desktop tab, you can seamlessly push an agent installation for an attended support. And if you transfer or need to transfer a session to a colleague, it's as easy as going to the session menu and clicking the transfer share button. From here, I can transfer or share this session with any other technician or department that is available. Talking about the agent for unattended support, since it runs as a service, you can simply engage on a remote session by clicking connect on the tech console. Let me show you. On my computer tab, I can reach that specific machine in my subgroups or groups of devices, hit the connect button, and I will be connected straight away. Now let us move into the administration console of SolarWinds Tech Control. I can access it from the tech console by clicking the admin area web version or going directly to the URL. This is where you can configure technician profiles and access permissions where multi-layer authentication is available to ensure proper user security. Create departments for request routing purposes. Consult on key performance indicators of all technicians providing support. Brand and customize your product utilization such as terms of service, automated emails, reporting, and more. And if you are constantly moving, you can also use the administration console to provide support and manage your queues, including full unattended device management. The only thing I need to do is click and enable the remote control mode. Now I can go to my device view, go to that specific machine, and click connect. You can create end user profiles. If you have clients that need to remotely access their devices outside their premises, instead of using the administration console or the tech console, they will make use of our own dedicated end user portal. APIs and integrations are also available, so you can utilize SolarWinds Tech Control further within your own flows and applications. Under reporting, there's a complete session history of all your remote support sessions. That includes everything done in session, any session recordings performed, chat with the end user, any actions while connected on a solo and state control session. And also, if I forgot to send, I can always send an email report to my client from here. But on that note, as part of our solo and state control offering, you will be able to provide session reports to clients on demand or in an automated fashion. Create surveys for internal or external purposes and use data analytics to understand what's happening within your own organization. This and much more is waiting for you. So are you ready to try solo and state control for yourself? Then please check the link below and request your trial today.